Hi, Dr. Jan here with Duke and the Doctor. Today we're going to take a look at the heart. Now here's our model heart. Your heart is actually the size of your fist and it is the most important muscle in your body. Its sole job is to pump blood to every cell in your body every minute of every day. Now imagine your heart is a house. There's two rooms upstairs, two rooms downstairs, there's a right and a left side. Now let's follow how blood goes through your heart. It starts on the right side of your heart, goes out to your lung to get oxygen, comes back to the left side of your heart, and then gets delivered to the rest of your body. Now veins carry no oxygen, so veins are blue. Every vein in your body delivers all of its blood to this big vein called the vena cava. It dumps, dumps directly into the top room of the right-hand side of your heart, the right atria. From there, it goes through the tricuspid valve into the downstairs right room called the right ventricle. Next, from your lower right ventricle, it goes out to the lungs via the pulmonary artery where it picks up oxygen, and it comes back into the top left room, which is known as the left atria. So from the left atria, it goes through the mitral valve down into the left ventricle the left downstairs. It then goes up into this aorta. This is the biggest artery of your body, which is why it is red. It carries oxygenated blood now to every organ of your body. Immediately off of the aorta are the coronary arteries. That's these right here, these red vessels on the outside of the heart. They are the vessels that feed the heart its own oxygen. The heart can't use the blood that goes through it. It has to use the blood that comes around it. Heart disease is our number one killer. When we talk about coronary artery disease, those arteries on the outside of the heart are the ones we're referring to that actually feed the heart muscle its own oxygen. So when we talk about bypass or stents, we're referring to the coronary arteries, which are four of them on the outside of the heart. Heart disease is our number one killer. It's important that you take care of your heart by exercising, by eating right, stress reduction, and I think supplements are important as well. So remember, don't be a statistic. Take care of your heart.